Hello everyone, here's a quick demo how you can <coughs> improve your conference technical specifications using, uh, using Azure DevOps information. Let's assume that you started some time before in your Azure DevOps wiki and you want to reference and embed content from there. It could be a readme file, it could be just your simple notes. Sorry, you'll uh, come and just copy a, a link. Then find Azure DevOps wiki macro, put your wiki link here. And that's it. Then, you, of course, you have some main tasks <coughs> uh, as well. So, it's the same approach. You will need to copy this link here. Azure DevOps work items. You can reference those. So, here's our, here are our two main tasks. And then we also have a list, a list or basically top related tasks, which are <coughs> coming from a query. We are getting query from Azure, but we don't want the whole query. We want only top 10 items to make sure that we just know the status of all of them, as well as we could use the same query, but at the bottom we want to so display the whole macro, not only top 10 items, but display all of them. That's it. So when we publish the page, we have a pretty neat technical specifications where you can see the power of Azure DevOps working together with Confluence. Here you can see that we enabled <coughs> or embedded Azure Wiki, which had a table, which has some source code. It's pretty basically neat and tidy, so it feels like it's native content. As well, you have main task, which display status, assignee, name and ID, and you, of course, can link to those tasks as well. You have two macros which display a list of work items. Thank you very much.